We are here today yep. to learn Breaker. King Fist Breaker. Brawl King Storm yep. Dragon Breaker, whatever it's going to be called. Uh, and yep. Mr. Benji, you're the guru. You're the teacher. Teach us, Sensei. Hey. Uh, the reason why I picked, first of all, I think I need to start with the reason why I picked this one over Sura. Mm -hmm. First of all, you don't have to head attack. When you're progging, when you're progging, head attack is a terrible experience because usually 90% of the time back is where it's safe hmm. right and front is usually like grabs they throw up on you they grab you throw you off the fucking platform mm -hmm. one shot you or whatnot right mm -hmm. content creating perspective as a streamer i do want to clear content fast yeah you, i don't want to drag like progging forever so Playing Sura, like head attack, it's not, head attack is not bad, but getting that experience is pretty tough. It takes, it, it takes longer than back attackers, basically, which is, I chose this non-positional breaker build, uh, which is very satisfying visually and the sound effects, man, it's so, so nice. Really? Your big punch, after your big punch, there's this aftermath, no, there's this like tornado that forms after your big punch and it's like, oh. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so nice. It's sick? Yeah, How, it's sick. This is a spec-based class, right? Yeah, it's very spec-based. Is it? Is it pretty slow? Spec Does it feel slow? Does it feel like shock scrapper slow oh. or striker death blow slow? It's it's definitely more... I, I would say it's about the same as striker. Let me go to tricks here okay. and kind of show you. Yeah, let's see it. So am I trying to like... Right now, am I trying to sell you King Fist or? Yes. What's going on? You've already cut. So like, yes. I'd like you to sell me on King Fist and then I'd like okay. to have you show us how to play it. Like the basic combo, maybe a, like a like a short parse, maybe like a 30 second parse, how it moves, uh, you know, and just some basic introductory information to the, to the class. Spec Breaker is like Melee Sork. Melee Sork, okay. Melee Sork, easy put. There's not a single kick. Skill. oh really mm -hmm. oh. it's all fist i guess skill rotation that you have to do in order to fill up identity okay it's pretty simple that's gonna give you a full bar mm -hmm. at the green gate at the top fully filled mm -hmm. and you burst hmm that's the whole rotation. Okay. And then the auto attack cancel. This okay. gives you cooldowns on all of your skills. Gotcha. Okay, so let's walk. Let's let's walk. Let's take this back and maybe not mm -hmm. attack on the boss just so that we can actually see the animations here. Okay, so this class, can you can you show us what skills you're using individually to build your meter? First, you start off with a little dash. Okay. And then this is the biggest meter building skill. Okay. S there. And that one right there. Got it. And then the A and R are about the same amount of identity building skill. Okay. That one. And that one. And then that one. Okay. And you are able to build that meter without actually hitting a target. No, you can't. You, you can't, can't build okay, this okay. meter without hitting the target. Okay. So okay. that's the that's the one that's one. Actually, you picked that up. That's one thing that spec breakers are actually complaining generating process if you miss a single hit then your rotation gets delayed by like four or five seconds Ooh, four or five seconds wow that that feels like a long time it is it is very punishing of course higher the cooldown gems the lesser it is but it's like at least like three four seconds jeez okay okay could you yeah. show us a clean mm -hmm. rotation but not like too fast like like Q. hey S. So that that is one full rotation. That is one rotation to build up identity. Gotcha. So all your yellow skills to build up the identity. One green skill, and then everything else yellow. Wow. 
What do you mean by one green skill and everything else? Okay, in in the to build the meter. Okay, okay. Uh, to build the meter, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So what's the first? It's, it's the S skill, right? The S skill. Yeah, this is a builder. Yes. Okay, gotcha. This is a builder. This is a filler. Filler DPS skill. D so these two DPS. make up for like 80% of your DPS. And then this one, like 10. And the other 10 are from like your bleed. And then, you know, building up meter. Gotcha. Okay. So your F skill and your Z, or not your Z identity. Is it your Z identity? Yeah, it is a Z. Yeah. Z identity. That is an attack skill that makes up majority of your DPS. Right. Gotcha. Could you show us like one clean full rotation? Sure. That was one rotation, one rotation, and then you start building again. Gotcha. Um, so you get to burst almost every 22 seconds in Shixian. Every 22 seconds. Okay, gotcha. Oh my gosh. There's an animation cancel with auto attacks. Can you walk us through that real quick? Yeah, basically, you know, okay, so here, if I use this one, that's the, that's me pressing auto attack. Uh -huh. After using a yellow skill. However, after I use my Z skill, you're going to see this white effect splash across the screen. Mm. Yeah, it's very subtle. That one right there. Yeah, that's the auto attack cancel. Ah, so there's an actual indicator on your screen that shows the, the cancel. Yeah, indicator and the sound. Do you have to hit the target with the auto attack for that to... You don't have to hit the target with the skill. But with the auto attack, you do. Gotcha. Okay. What does the cancel so do again? It it gives you cooldowns while your identity is. Here, let me show you. Okay. Now pay attention to my F skill. Mm -hmm. The cooldowns on the F skill. Yeah, right there. Yeah, it's jumping. Oh, it's jumping pretty quick. So with a level seven cooldown gem, if mm -hmm. everything goes right, by the time you finish uh, building up your identity, mm -hmm. your F skill will be back. Gotcha. So you're pretty much just rotating it constantly. You have everything up if you're being fully efficient. Right. Okay. But in a real rate scenario, that's probably not going to happen. You're not going to be landing every right. single auto attack, right? Right. So that's why I recommend a higher cooldown gem for F skill at least. Gotcha. Makes sense. So every single skill you're using, you're auto attacking after, right? Uh huh. Can you show Basically, us? Basically, what you're supposed mm -hmm. to do is towards the end of the animation, press auto attack. Just like that. That was pretty much what it was. Okay. Yeah. Could you show us like a Q followed by W followed by E just without auto attack, and then Q followed by W followed by E with an auto attack each, just to just so that we can kind of see the animation without hit, okay. without hit without hitting the boss, just like in blank space. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can you see it? Yeah. That's with the auto attack, right? Yeah. Okay. Like, do you have to have like a buff up? Like, do you need to have your Z up for that auto attack function to work or, or no? Yeah, it has to be after you burst with your Z. Gotcha. Do you punch faster during that Z window with your auto attack? You attacks? do get, I think it's like 15, 20%. Okay. Attack speed, not movement speed. Okay, okay. 20%, 20% attack speed. Okay, okay. Gotcha. So the, the cancels do have to be during that during that window. So if you let's say the boss phases and you lose your Z, then you're just essentially starting back from zero. Pretty much how you originally built meter meter to right, right. Right. Okay. Okay. That sounds yeah. pretty good, man. That sounds really engaging. I like the idea of that quite a bit. The two things I really like about King Fist, I know Sura has this as well. The push immunity shield. Mm -hmm. This king also has the e mm -hmm. the this is my distant closure by the way it's a big jump oh man this oh. is push immune oh wow wait it's push immune it's push immune not paralysis immune it's wow push immune. holy shit. also this one 
My F is paralysis immune, but this is push immune. Which one was that? That's the Z skill. That's the Z, yeah. That's the big Z. It's actual push immune. Holy crap. Okay, so, okay. Uh, yeah, so your main, one of your main DPS skill is actually protected from getting like, unless you get grabbed. Right, of course. That's I've insane. gotten grabbed by Akan in, in, in midair using that skill. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, man. Okay, so what would you say is the weakness of this class? Out okay, so it's for me, it sounds like one weakness is obviously punishing if you miss your skills, right? Um, uh -huh. One of the downsides would be also um, getting cucked by mechanics, right? Let's say you're in your Z window and then a mech hits in, you lose that, you got to kind of start over. Mm -hmm. um, and that's, I feel like that is that is that pretty much it? Like, what else would you say? That's pretty much it. The only thing that people complain about um king face breaker is identity building you know mm. you see how like okay so these three are the biggest eye generating uh -huh. skills and once you start casting them you can't really move and the animation is pretty long mm. right you can turn around right. using r but that's kind of the that's kind of the cons i guess right gotcha. but that's the only con i can think of honestly okay other than that <laughs> hmm no i can't think of one really other than that yeah i love this class so much really is this your main yeah it's gonna be my main pretty soon Damn. the reason okay here's a here's a here's my reason why i picked this is why this is my um main class i've played eo soul fist right mm -hmm. and destroyer which both of them, Destroyer surprisingly requires a lot of like focus while mm -hmm. you're streaming because you have to land head attacks, right? Mm -hmm. And Eosophis, Eosophis, obviously you have to, uh, you have to be thinking mm -hmm. consistently about dominion management and hype management and all that. Mm -hmm. I cannot talk. Mm. And as a streamer, that's a bad thing, right? Right. Like if I'm not talking, just raiding, just sweating my balls off and I can't talk, I think that's a really bad thing. Mm. But this is pretty, I feel like this is pretty on the casual side. Yeah. And yeah, that's why I like this. It's easy. It's easier. Okay. But you're it's still easier, casual, pumping. bursty. This sounds really good, man. Could you, okay. Could you show me? Cause yeah. like once you hit your Z, you're in uh -huh. a window, right? Like he's like, yeah, I, right. I understand you're in a window. So you got to do it quick. So mm -hmm. could you go through your rotation one more time, but just literally slow, kind of like how you're doing that first segment of the rotation earlier, but can you do okay. it even through the Z window? Obviously the Z buffs gonna gonna wear out, right? But just so that we can right. get a slow down visual on like a very full rotation slow. Hold on, let me build adrenaline. Okay, okay. Oh, on that note with adrenaline, do you have like that thing with striker where you can just kind of pre pre build the adrenaline with throwaway skills, or are there no throwaway skills with this? Uh, Q is Q is a throwaway skill. Yep, it's the low cooldown one. Okay, like if you miss a Q on a target, are you cucked? Uh, no, not really. Not okay. Okay. I mean, the, the cooldown there's a there's a tripod. If you land, it reduces the cooldown by fifty percent. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. So it's supposed to be eight seconds, oh. but it's like four seconds. Jeez, okay, okay, okay. Oh, by the way, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. before you press your F, you have to turn on Z. Okay, 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 okay. So you turn on Z, you hit F, mm -hmm. and then do you do double bur burst? Do you hit, you turn on your Z and then hit Z, F? Z, turn it on, uh -huh. F, charge, and then Z, hold it down. Ooh. So like your F and Z going back to back is similar to like using back to back Tiger Strike and Tiger Emerges like back to back, right? Kind of for Striker. Yeah, but a lot faster. A lot faster, right, right. And protected. Okay, so the reason why you use F first mm -hmm. is because your blue skills mm -hmm. are buffed by your uh, shock gauge, the green gauge, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's why you want to have full green gauge. Mm -hmm before start bursting and you know how i i have no green gauge but as soon as yeah. i start charging you see how that uh, charges up oh yeah 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 so the z that's why it goes in that specific order gotcha gotcha so when you activate your z and you get your buff uh you use your f which burns your meter your green uh -huh. meter and then you follow that up with the z active skill the burst skill uh -huh. which which instantly takes you from zero to 100 maximum green meter so that that also has full damage. 
Right. Gotcha. Makes sense. What you can do, okay, there you're gonna end up with times. You're gonna mm -hmm. end up sometimes that you don't have full green meter, mm -hmm. but your identity is up. What you can do is just go with uh, Z first, mm. and then do auto attacks, build up, and then use F. Mm -hmm. But then your cooldown on your next rotation is gonna be pretty long. Mm -hmm. Here's another. Okay, I'm I'm am talking about how to recover your how to recover from like messing up a skill rotation to okay. build up meter. Let's say okay, let's say you miss your S, one of the biggest identity building skill. Uh huh. In that case, just use your D, which is a filler DPS skill. Mm -hmm. It also fills up quite a lot of identity. Mm -hmm. And then burst. Okay. Wait, do you... Do I want to make... Before I hit F... Sorry, I can't hear your 3D effects. I'm just kidding. No, yeah, what's okay. up? If I want to hit F... Yeah. Do I need to make sure my green meter is full, right? And that's being filled up by my yellow skills, or does that right. get filled up when I open my Z buff? It doesn't, right? I, that's just filling up from my yellow skills, right? Right. Okay. 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 Gotcha. Uh, Onyx is asking, ask him if the timer of the Z can be reduced with level ten cooldown gems. So instead of let's say twenty-two seconds of rebuilding, it will be like eighteen seconds of rebuilding. The timer is not going to be affected. Your Z skill would be, but the timer is not affected. I feel like it would be relevant because of the time it takes for you to rebuild the meter, right? Yeah, Okay. that okay. too. But okay, let me show you, hold on. Okay. You see how there's a cooldown on the Z skill? Mm hmm That's going to be reduced. Right, right. But this, but this yellow timer is not gonna be reduced. Right, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You played Striker, okay? Uh-huh. How much more damage are you doing on Breaker? On, on King Fist oh. Breaker over than Striker? Is it not it, even close? Over Striker? Yeah. Death Blow Striker. DPS and Trixian, Striker is probably stronger. Okay, okay. Or similar. At par or Death Blow Striker is probably a little stronger. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. In a real raid scenario, I, I'm pretty confident I can gap about 20 gear scores. Jeez. Yeah, I, dude, I mean, if you're parsing pretty much the same damage or similar yeah. damage, yeah. only you're not fucking back attacking, you know what I mean? That, yeah, there's no way you'll be able to keep up with that. Usually mm -hmm. Hitmaster should be parsing less damage, right? To keep up with the, to keep, so so that the gap between a ba a, an, an, an Entropy class versus a Hitmaster class. Uh, to yeah, make but they that. buffed Ignite Sword. It's fucking OP right now. Oh man, where is where is Kingfist top DPS? Is it top three? Where, where would you put this? I mean, it's definitely S. -tier. Everyone's telling me both specs are S tier. It's actually no DPS wise. It's lower than lower than Sora for sure. Lower and than Surge. Sur okay. Yeah, but I would say it's in a pretty good spot. I I don't know about you guys, in chat, but I'm sold. I'm gonna be running this. I'm gonna be it's, doing Kingfist. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing Kingfist, boys. Oh, the engravings. Let me talk about engravings. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, in the build. A lot of people have questions about, is it Adrenaline 1 or is it Adrenaline 3 and then EP1? There's a thing called Elixirs, which is something you find from Valdis, which is another Abyssal Dungeon. Mm -hmm. There's two Bis, uh, Bis Elixirs. One of them is like 12% more damage if you crit. Mm-hmm. And the other one is like 8.5% additional damage plus 7.5% crit rate. And these elixirs are, I'm just gonna say, it's fucking RNG. Mm, yeah. So you don't know which one you'll you know, end up with. Right, 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 right. I'm just gonna simply explain because I don't wanna explain everything about elixirs. Sure. So those two, so if you end up with a crit rate elixir, uh, my suggestion is use adrenaline one. But if you end up with critical elixir, which is 12% more damage on crit, then I would say adrenaline level three and then EP one. And the stat, oh, wait, 1800 wait. is enough. So you would take the, you, so yeah, yeah, sorry. You would remove cursed all and then take adrenaline three and then EP one. Is that what you do? Oh, that's another thing. It's either cursed all or hitmaster. Okay, okay. Wait, hold on. For EP1 Adrenaline 3, what are you taking out from what you have there? I would use Adrenaline 3 and take out Crystal, yeah. Crystal, okay, okay, okay. The reason why I'm using Crystal instead of Hitmaster is because Crystal is hella cheaper. It's like half the, it's like half the amount. Damn, okay, okay. My, uh, so I bought the ring 
with class engraving and mm -hmm. crystal. 100 quality, this was 150k. This one with Hitmaster would probably cost double. 150k gold for 100 quality class engraving accessory is not that bad. Mm. Especially if it's spec, right? Right, right, right. All right, so should I go do this uh, Guardian Let's see one? it. Let's see the Guardian. Wait, so you will be the only one doing Theamine with Breaker? Yeah, Holy they shit, might hard. Yeah. Yo. Dude, I love how there's no directional there. Oh my gosh, you could just punch from anywhere. Oh my gosh. Oh, 460. Oh! Watch this. Push immune! Oh. That's so good. Dude, it's just like constant uptime, bro. This is insane. Yeah. yeah, it's definitely breaker. It's a breaker angle, guys. Oh, I'm oh. creating pretty nice, huh? Yeah, I without mean, any crit synergy. All your all your big skills have crit so far. Nice space. Try doing that with 200 ping, bro. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was the first one that missed. Oh, the second part didn't hit. That so your Z, it's actually a two hit skill, huh? Like the damage uh -huh. is in two hits, yeah? So I noticed your R skill, you're not actually holding down all the way. It's like a quick cast. Uh, I'm actually, no, I'm- oh, I, are you? Or is that the right Uh, one? you're not, there's a way to not hold it all the way down. Mm -hmm. But I like to hold it all the way down because if you don't hold it all the way down, you have to use an extra Q skill. Ah, oh, I gotcha, I gotcha. You're not going to use Z until you build meter to use F first, right? Right. Okay. Okay, so now it's F, full send mode? Boom. Oh, it dodged. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Pretty simple. Okay, so you're just... You're, you're building... It's pretty simple. You just build meter with your yellow skills plus your S skill. And you're alternating your audio simple. attack. Mm -hmm. And then you and then you full send... Make sure you have full green meter. Full send it with F. Hit your Z. All, hit your identity stance. And then hit Z again. Yep. Very 46%. simple. 46%. All right, chat. I'm sold. <laughs> It's a breaker angle, chat. It's a breaker angle. All right, brother. Listen, I'm going to let you go. I appreciate your time. I'm going to do some reaction. I've got a couple of videos to watch. Uh, I, sure, appreciate, sure, man. I appreciate you, man. I'll hit you up after. Show sure, later. See you guys. Bye, say, chat. Peace. Say goodbye to Benji.